Hello, today I will show you uh, how to uninstall a potentially unwanted application called NSAND. This is file sharing uh, program and service uh, that installs in a, in a bundle with free software, uh, freeware apps like media converters, media players, uh, or through uh, third party advertising networks. So it installs without user user's consent and uh, appears from nowhere. That's why many users want to uninstall it. And it can cause certain troubles when you try to uninstall it. So as you can see, I uh, perform installation of any center on my test computer. And after this, uh, I will uh, test a couple of uh, anti-malware programs. Uh, to check if any sand uh, is in the database so they can effectively remove it because uh, manual removal uh, is quite complicated so spy hunter found uh, 80 entries uh, related to any sand and uh, they have the detection is uh, Potentially unwanted program pup.nsend. So you can click Quick Fritz and it will remove uh, all Fritz at once. Uh, of course, we will try uh, an uninstall feature. Uh, in some cases, it will work. It creates uh, two uninstall entries. One is called nsend any file, any size, anywhere. And the second is nsend. In a send uh, with a version, in my case 1.018. So you need to uninstall both these entries to fully uninstall in a send. Uh, as you can see, it shows me an error that uh, some services prevent any send from correct uninstall, and that's the issue that after it finishes. Uh, users still have uh, pop-ups on the, on the desktop offering to backup or file share some files so we uninstalled uh, all entries from control panel and let's check uh, what we have left uh, in internet explorer as you remember, uh, it created an add-on, so now we are free of add-ons. In toolbars and extensions section, we have no add-ons. Firefox and Google Chrome should also be clean because NSend uh, installs extensions in these browsers and shows you may show you that advertising ads pop-ups. Uh, you can manually check this and remove uh, any extension re related to any send if it exists. And do the same for Google Chrome. Go to settings. Extensions and click recycle bin in your unwanted extension. So you can also use a uh, free uh, tool called Malware by Sentinel Malware. Uh, it also has uh, an ascent in the database and it classified it as potential unwanted program pup.optional.nsend. So you can also use AFS Browser Cleanup to clean up your browsers from any um, unwanted changes or remove unwanted extension created by NSend. Check download links in description. To reset settings of a particular browser, we need to, to open the tab in AWS Browser Cleanup and click Reset Settings button. After this, you need to choose Preferred mm, Search Engine and click Complete Free Cleanup. If 
you have several browsers, you need to do this for every uh, browser tab in this program. This is much easier than uh, resetting your browser settings manually. So that's basically it. Thanks for watching. Check the links in the description. Subscribe to my channel. Goodbye.